Hello everybody, welcome to this another um, another unboxing today. This is going to be the unboxing of the 2011 Old Sine Donkey Kong plush. So as you can see here, here it is an old, oh, it's not here yet because I still need to unbox it. Of course, I need to make sure not to damage the plush because this thing is on really, really tight. So I had to cut it, oh, I almost cut open his face as you, could, you guys can see there. So here is a look at the face, and I need to pull it open more because I can't get all of him, all of him out, of course. So here is a 2011 Sine tagged Donkey Kong plush. This looks almost like the All Star one. So you can see here, this looks Donkey Kong small plush 2011 Nintendo. Uh, let's see, it's logo, old little buddy logo, made in China, and here is his touch tag. Made in China, 2011 Super Mario. You can see he is really, really fluffy and like really, like super, super soft. And here's a tie and here's the back of him. So you can see here, now we have a lot more Donkey Kong plushes. Like I said, pretty soon we might, we're thinking about doing a girl invasion. So maybe we can see this guy in another video. So, or this guy finally in another video. So let's get on to some comparisons. <laughs> so here's a quick overview of the Donkey Kong. You can see that his hair, or not his hair, his ties there and all its glory. You can also see he's very soft. As I said, the eyes are much bigger, or not much bigger, but like th they're a little different. So let's <coughs> now compare to a normal Donkey Kong, which is the Mario Party 5 Donkey Kong. So you can see the pretty much difference. These are both by Sine. This is in a second attempt at a Donkey Kong, and you can see it's a little better. Because I say a little because both are really good and both are really accurate. So you can see the difference here. <coughs> that um, this one's more up, and that one's more down, like it's crawling in a way, and this one is just like in a standing pose. So you can pretty much see the difference with these guys, like how they are. This one's a little more different with his hands and all that stuff. So you can see here, here is a comparison of these two. This one looks more serious, and this one looks like a crazy cuckoo monster. And you can see the hair difference too. Now this one has two points, and this one only had one, because I'm like, pretty sure in the old games you couldn't really tell how many points Donkey had, so they just went with one. So you can see now the, <coughs> the tie difference here is that the tie is an iron on, and I like that they actually put like a real tie material for him, because this is like some kind of tie fabric, but then they made it all cutesy wootsy and made it all soft in the newer ones. Probably trying to appeal to little kids and all that, probably. And you can see here the back of the tag, of course. The tags are a little different because they're placed in the same spot, basically. But you can see the touch tag on this one. That one's a Mario Party 5, and this one's uh, Super Mario. So, pretty nice. And now let's go on to the All Star Donkey Kong. You can see there's not much of a difference here because this is the newest Donkey Kong ever. So, you can see the head is more down. This one's even more in like a crawling pose. This one, this one's pretty good, but this one looks more like, now it looks like it's like a crawling spider or something. I don't know how to explain it. Now it looks like instead of almost slouching down, now this one's just completely slouching down like it's like lazy or something. So not a big fan of this one, but they're pretty much the same thing. You can like see the hand difference here. The hands are closer on this one. The hands are more like spaced out on this one. More sturdy, a little less sturdy. And you can see here the tide the ties are basically the same, so not much to say about the ties because they're the exact same thing. They still have the two points as well. Same tag placement, they basically have the same tags, just you can see here, 2017 made in Vietnam and 2011 made in China. So now <clears throat> let's compare it to the ugly fake Donkey Kong. This one we made an unboxing of, we uh, still edit the title out of this one right now to make it fake because this one turns out be it was a fake one and you can see the big difference. Ugly, ugly, ugly bootleg. So now let's compare to the beast himself, the Kelly Toy Donkey Kong. So you can see there's not there's a lot of a difference here. You can see this one standing, the tie is actually tied completely. And um, you can see the DK logo is actually more of an orange. You can see the face facial features are a little different. I still love this Donkey Kong a lot. Probably one of my most favorite ones because of like how huge it is and stuff. You can see this one's like it has carpet fabric. So if you feel the carpet here, because I'm comparing this to the carpet, so you can see carpet, pretty much the same thing, just a little more softer. And yeah, these are all the oh yeah Diddy Kong. So here is Diddy Kong. We still need old one. But these are how the pals are in, in like all the games and all that stuff. 
So here is it. Here it is. So let me show all the DK DKs I have. Or we have because Sean has Donkey Kongs too. Is this all of them? Yeah, this is all of them. Uh, why am the fake? Why is the old one all the way back here? Well, I need to put the fake one back there because that one's not that important. So you can see the complete trio of Donkey Kongs. I still want to get play-by-play -play Dixie Kong and all that. But anyway, that pretty much wraps up this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hit the subscribe button if you want to see more unboxings, review videos, and of course the main core plush videos in the future. So thank you guys so much for watching. Bye-bye. Woof, woof, woof.